Hi everyone. Are you ready? Yeah. 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 And here's the CLB news team. Hi everyone. Here is CLB News Team. What happening in this week? Hi, this is Jeff from the CLB News Team, and I'm going to tell you about World Autism Awareness Day. World Autism Awareness Day is an annual event which aims to bring awareness about what autism is as well as how we can support autistic people in our society by recognizing the special this special day in our schools, homes and workplaces will ensure that the values of diversity and inclusion are upheld. The this event is great is a great way to educate yourself and others about how autism can present and how we can accommodate everyone based on their individual needs. World Autism Day was established in 2007 by the United Nations General Assembly. It is celebrated on April 2nd every year. The, the theme for the day in 2024 is color. You can celebrate this special day by expressing your yourself by wearing colors. How to celebrate World Autism Awareness Day. Wear blue, the official event color, to help raise awareness. Share your support for this day on social media. Take part in some fundraising for a local or national autism charity. Get involved in events in events run by the autism community. Support autism friendly businesses. Or you can read a book about autism and inclusion. My favorite CLB programs are the Study Right program and the Chantley Woods program that I go to each week, every week. Staff shout out Sandy Phillips and Leanne, Leanne Sheehan are hard working staff at CLB and Fisher House. They do so much for us there and their assistance with us is much appreciated. This is Jeff H signing off. Hello CLB, I'm Chris Stafford. Um, I'm gonna be reporting back on my game Warframe. I recently got um, a full um, part-time job working at Metro and I'm gonna be working um, four, uh, three days a week and um, I'm making, I'm doing, um, besides that, I've been playing, um, I've been playing Warframe again. I'm on this new quest called the New War. <clears throat> and I got two new Warframes and a, um, it's, called, it's called a Necromech. And a Necromech is basically a, um, it's called a Voidrig. And that's V-O-I-D-R-I-G. And this thing is basically like a giant, suit of armor that you wear and your operator goes into the your warframe and then the warframe goes into the water rig now 
aside from that, I also got a new Warframe called Octavia. And Octavia is basically a music-based Warframe that has these two things on her arms called the Mandacord. And it's basically a... you Your Mandacord is your weapon. And it's really, really, really cool. And it's one of those... And it's basically... You can make music from it. And... Um, you basically can choose from different songs that people have made. Like, for example, you can make, um, you can make, um, Sandstorm by Darude. You can make other EDM songs that are really high pitched or high based to decimate your enemies, to decimate the Gurnier and the Corpus. And, um, yeah, other than that, I've been focusing on Warframe here at the library and at my work. So, um, that's pretty much it. So, I I don't know what else to say. Other, you guys hope you had a happy Easter. Have a great week and make sure you stay dry because it's it's supposed to be really it's supposed to rain out all week. And yes, I did get a haircut. Thank you for noticing. And until next week, this is Chris Stafford signing off. Peace. Hey there, this is your weather with Dave, and this is what's happening this week. On Monday, April 1st, we're going to have some sun and clouds, and at night, more clouds. On Tuesday, April 2nd, we're going to have rain, and it's going to continue all the way through the night. On Wednesday, April 3rd, we're going to have some rain, and it's going to continue all the way through the night. On Thursday, April 4th, we're going to have uh, no more snow. And it's going to continue all the way through the night. It's supposed to be nice out. On Friday, April 5th, we're going to have some sun and clouds. And at night, more clouds. Here's your weekend. On Saturday, April 6th, we're going to have some sun and clouds. And at night, more clouds. On Sunday, April 7th, we're going to have some sun and clouds. And at night, more clouds. This has been your Weather with Dave. Happy Easter and happy April Fools. And like I always say, stay safe. This is Adam Pettit from on the CB News team. I'm gonna talk to you about the Beast Boys. These Beast Boys are from California. They 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 do the the tour and do a concert every, every each summer. The first tour they do Canada's Wonderland. I went to see them there on my birthday. Mum and Dad took me there on my birthday to see the Beast Boys. And I loved it. I loved every song they did. I loved California Girls. How Me Wander, Little Miss Scoop, Seven USA, and and California Girls. Those are my favorite songs of the Beach Boys. This you can find the tickets on online or 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 buy them. This is Adam Pratt from the CB News team. Thank you very much, the Beach Boys. Hey, sports fans, this is your sports reporter, Brad Cook, for the CLB News team. Since this theme is all about autism, I would like to share a bit about what we can do to help kids with autism. We can take them to a sporting event, like baseball, like a baseball game, so they can enjoy themselves. And... And I highly recommend it because it's fun and it helps them to enjoy the game. To sports, and we begin in the NHL. And Austin Matthews has 62 goals this season. Can he get 63 when the Toronto Maple Leafs play the Tampa Bay Lightning on Scotiabank Wednesday Night Hockey? You can watch that game on Sportsnet. In March Madness news, Zach... Edie and the Boilermakers are in the final four. Can they win their next game? You can watch March Madness on PSN. And finally, 
the boys of summer are back. And you can watch them take on the Houston Astros on Sportsnet 1. This has been your Sports Flash Autism Update. I am Brad Cook from the CLB News Team signing off. Now, happy Autism Day, everyone. Hello, my name is Tyler Sheeran. I will be talking about the TV show Full House and Fuller House. When Danny Tanner's wife dies, the San Francisco sportscaster gets support in from of two new roommates, which is his the brother-in-law and the party boy Jesse and his stand-up comic friend Joey, his two friends from school. The duo helps out with raising the three Tanner daughters, EJ, Stephanie, and Michelle Tanner. Jesse is a uh, music writer. He likes to sing the Beach Boys and he opens his own club called Jesse and the Rippers. Full House used to be on Netflix, but it isn't anymore. So you have to watch them on DVD or Prime video or YouTube or Google Play. It started in it has eight seasons and started in 1987. Bob Saget, John Stamos, Candace Cameron, Jody Sweeten, Dave Kluwer, Andre Barber, and the TV show's pretty funny. I like all three of the, all of the characters. And Fuller House came out in 2016, which is the next sequel of Full House. That also had five seasons when that's when DJ is a mom and Stephanie is a mom and her friend Kim is a mom. Stephanie, the daughter is the father, Bob Saget's in it and DJ Tanner and Stephanie Tanner, the two sisters are in it. And the two, the uncle is married to his girlfriend. Fuller House is available on Netflix and the library. I also like the phrases when Michelle says, you're in big trouble, mister. And Stephanie oh. says, how, how rude. And DJ says, oh my Atlanta, when there's a mess. In Fuller House, the TV series lasted until 2016 to 2020. This is Tyler Sheeran signing off. Hot news team, I am Sally C at the news CLB. And here is other birthdays for CLB. It's Evan, April the 5th. We got Cole, April the 6th. Parker, to wish him a great birthday. So, this is a special birthday to 
so Lucy, to wish me a happy birthday on a Tuesday this year. So I wish me a really great birthday. And we and then we had Natalie, April the 13th. And then we got Simon, the April the 14th. So we got Richard, April the 15th. Michelle, April the 15th. Then we have Jean, April the 15th. And then all of the famous birthdays are Jamie Lynn Spears is April the 4th, 1991. She has two children and she also has TV shows. Sorry 101 and Sorry 102. That's, that's a movie of Sorry 102 that you have to see. And then we have one more birthday. We got Kristen Stewart, April the 9th, 1990. Kristen Stewart is also an actor, um, actress in Twilight. So I hope everyone has a great birthday this year. And I'm Sarah and I'm signing off. Hi, this is Adam Murray. Tonight, I'll be reporting on the, the festival and and the events. The Standard Music Festival, Canada largest free music festival. The, the date of the Standard Music Festival for this year is June 13th to June 16th. Standardmusic.ca. The Rib Fest Monday and on Labor Day weekend. This is Adam signing off. Bye. Thank you very much to see uh, to see the CLB News team. I see you in next week. I am Sarah and I'm signing off.